January 14, 1963. George Wallace is sworn in as Alabama's new governor and vows segregation now, segregation tomorrow, segregation forever. Months later, Wallace stands in the schoolhouse door at the University of Alabama trying to block black students from enrolling there. I deem it to be my solemn obligation and duty to stand before you, representing the rights and sovereignty of this state and its people. 1784. The United States ratifies a peace treaty with Britain, formally ending the American Revolution. 1943. During World War II, President Franklin D. Roosevelt and British Prime Minister Winston Churchill meet in Casablanca, Morocco. The Allied leaders pledged to continue the war until the unconditional surrender of the Axis powers. 1954. Baseball great Joe DiMaggio and actress Marilyn Monroe get married in San Francisco. Their marriage lasts less than a year. And 1952. The Today Show debuts on NBC with Dave Garraway as the original host of what remains a morning TV powerhouse. Today in history, January 14th, Ross Simpson, The Associated Press.